Thanks for joining us today at Island Ford Superstore, located on Norcross Road just off the Trans-Canada Highway in Duncan, BC, in the Couchin Valley on Vancouver Island. Today we're looking at a 2015 Dodge Journey RT in pitch black. With a black leather interior and seating for seven, this four-door SUV has a 3.6 liter V6 all-wheel drive engine. It's easy to get into this vehicle, just talk to our sales team. They'll be happy to take you out on a test drive. Storage cup holder and speaker in the door as well as powered locks, windows, and mirrors. The driver enjoys a powered seat with lumbar support. Off to the side there, you have your lighting controls and your dash lights. Your steering wheel can tilt and telescope. On the face of your steering wheel, you have dash controls, cruise controls, hands-free dialing, and media controls with volume. This is a push start, so foot on the brake, key in the pocket, and press the start button. Up above in the dash is where you'll see any important messages. There's also a menu you can toggle through. Fuel economy, vehicle speed, trip info, tire KPA, vehicle info, messages, and turn menu off. These also all have submenus. Off to the side there's your touchscreen media display center with AM, FM, Sirius satellite radio, CD, Bluetooth, and auxiliary line in. You also have navigation and it's also where you'll see your rear backup camera view when going in reverse. You can also click over into controls for settings such as your heated steering wheel and heated seats for both driver and passenger. Below that you have your hazard lights and traction control as well as dual climate control with AC as well as front and rear defrost. Volume and tuner located just there and below that SD card and, and CD player. Just below that you have a 12 volt outlet and a little storage bin. Couple of cup holders, automatic shifter located just there, and in your armrest there's a clip on the end. Pull that up and there's plenty of room in there as well as that removable bin. 12 volt outlet, auxiliary line in, and USB outlet. Off to the sides your locking glove compartment. Up above, auto dimming rear view mirror, lighting controls, garage door opener, sunglasses holder, and when you press that three quarters of the way back, you'll be able to see into the back. When you're ready to open up that sunroof, simply click to let in some light and air. 19 inch wheels, chrome door handles with intelligent access, driver side fuel cap. Your back hatch is a little bit of a spoiler as well as a rear windshield wiper. Just below that middle D and Dodge is your backup camera. On the bumper you have sensors and you also have dual exhaust. When you're ready to open up that trunk, there's a handle just below that E in Dodge. Simply put your hand in that handle and pull up. You'll notice the inside's nice and roomy and also carpeted. That third row folds down in a 50-50 split with a two-point pulley system, which I've already done to show you how it looks. On the right-hand side there, there's some storage and little hooks to hold things up. On the left-hand side, a 12-volt outlet and a flashlight. And just below, pull that up. And there's some more storage in there. When you're ready to close up that trunk, there's a handle on both left and right hand sides. Simply put your hand in one of those handles and pull down. And it is now securely closed. You can lock it up and walk away or head out on your latest adventure. Your key fob also has remote start. Storage cup holder and speaker in the door as well as powered windows. The second row has seating for three in a 60-40 split. When you're ready to access that third row, there's a couple of options. There's that handle on the right hand side of the seat there, and there's a couple of handles just below. Simply pick any one of those, pull it up to fold the seat down for access into the third row with a seating for two and a 50-50 split. The third row has three point seat belts as well as cup holders, and up above, vents and lighting. When you're ready to put that second row seat back in its original position, simply take your hand underneath and push until it clicks in the upright position. At the base of the seat are anchors for baby seats. In the center, an armrest with a couple of cup holders. On the floor, carpeted mats. Behind the front seat, slim pocket. In the center there, AV, 12 volt outlet, as well as 115 volt outlet. And up above, a DVD player, rear climate control, vents, hooks, handles, and lighting. Privacy glass, roof rails and roof racks, heated and powered side view mirrors, halogen headlights, and fog lights, and so many more reasons to visit us at Island Ford Superstore, BC's number one rated Ford dealer.